uh, to short term would be uh, to um, try to pull together uh, other uh, government sectors to come up with a long range plan that, that makes sense, uh, that would protect the environment, protect neighborhood uh, quality of life, uh, and uh, protect the, uh, the public realm. Government does not have all of the answers or solutions. Um, and big issues like uh, uh, mobility, transportation, mode of transportation, uh, you know, these are, in my judgment, community-wide uh, type issues. Uh, one of the things I think would be reasonable to take a look at is the city's uh, current uh, structure. Uh, Rather not, the current structure is uh, conducive uh, to meeting current city challenges. Uh, and how do we build the right infrastructure, the right personnel, the right skill sets, and the right talent? Uh, I think the current structure is supportive of preservation type issues, uh, growth management type issues, uh, but not transportation type issues. And so I personally would turn to uh, organizations like the Coastal Conservation League, uh, an organization that has done massive amount of studies uh, and research uh, and have the knowledge base to help guide uh, a, a process that may lead to better outcomes. Um, I don't think the answer or solution exists right now in city government or any form of government. We may need to look to the private sector and the nonprofit sector for guidance and direction. And I'm certainly willing to take a back seat and, and take a lead and a cue from such entities uh, to help us address the issue. In terms of prioritizing uh, specific roads uh, for improvement, uh, if you're Wes Ashley along the Glen McConnell Parkway, uh, folks would say, hey, this should be number one. You know, you, you have to fix this. If you're on Savannah Highway and you prioritize that, folks, well, foul, no, no, we have a greater amount of, or River Road or Folly Road. Um, you know, it's, it's, as opposed to cherry picking which should come first, I think, the approach should be a more global view of road conditions in general. And I guarantee you, if we were to do that, we would find that a lot of the current or existing traffic problems and congestions that we're having can be addressed with some minor tweaks and fixes here and there. Uh, and we won't necessarily have to spend, uh, as the number one project, the Glen McConnell Parkway. Uh, we can maybe do multiple projects at the same time. My feelings about bike share program, I want to make sure I understand that concept too. When I, when I hear it, I'm thinking, okay, uh, Maurice picks a bike up at the corner of Broad uh, and um, uh, say Meeting Street, and I, I paddle down to uh, Calhoun and Meeting, and I lock it, leave it for someone else to grab and, and run with. If I'm correct, I think that's one of the coolest things that we can do, and I certainly would support that. That, to me, is not something you spend a whole lot of time talking about. You, it makes sense, you do it, and you move on to the next issue. And if we can do it, and do it safely, um, I'm all for it. I would be very supportive of that. Um, uh, biking is a form of exercising. And, you know, whenever you're doing something active like that, you're improving the health of the community. And I'm all for it. So uh, uh, I, I'm not adverse to it. Um, uh, would love to look at it and see if we can make it happen. You know, it would be nice if we could, uh, in terms of having a specific company to come in and put Carter back under 
uh, new management. Uh, uh, wouldn't it be nice if we can renegotiate SCE and G back to the table? Uh, to take over the transportation system, given the profit that they take out of uh, communities across this uh, uh, state. That's a loss that they can absorb, uh, and they can do it and do it better uh, and uh, get this project out of the pocketbooks of the uh, taxpayers and the citizenry here. Um, but I, I can't, I'm sure there are private sector firms out there that, um, that have a proven track record that can come in and, uh, and do it better, uh, structure it better uh, than the way it is now. And I certainly would be very, very open to uh, uh, pursue that as mayor.